As we sort of went through maybe 20,000 connected units, you suddenly start to learn how difficult and important it is to keep a general overview of everything that's going on with your connected devices. Hi, well I'm, uh, I'm Eric, I'm the CEO and founder of Podpoint and we're the largest independent network of charging points in the UK. Uh, today we're in our headquarters in Shoreditch in London, um, so there's a total of about 170 people, about 120 of them in the office here, and this is where we look after our entire network of nearly 60,000 charging points from here. So we're totally data driven at Podpoint, we love everything. If we can answer a question using data, we think that's the best way. If there's no guesswork, then you can use the facts. And dashboards, like the things we've got with Device Pilot, really let us get that actual insight out of our devices. So Device Pilot is providing us a visualization on our estate of charge points. Uh, provides indicators such as uptime uh, and all the other important tools uh, and alerting systems that we use to uh, constantly uh, make sure that our uptime is as best as possible. Device Pilot is quite a, a unique platform which uh, would take a long time and be very expensive to recreate uh, for any company. Before, there was a lot of Excel <laughs> but to do data visualization. It was Excel or other tools, uh, we, also, we obviously have like data analysis tools, but they're not so much oriented on visualization. And I think um, Device Pilot is providing the step ahead where you can really go um, and set up your KPIs uh, in a much more smarter way than any, any of the system I personally used before. We've got something like 60,000 charge points constantly beaming information back to us. And that just means you've got an enormous amount of information. But how do you pull out the insight you really need to make business decisions? Over my shoulder, you can see a whole pile of the dashboards we've got, including stuff that tells us what the current availability of our network is, if we've got any issues we need to deal with, and even stuff around what, whether the grid is currently low carbon at the moment. Well, I mean, Device Pilot is giving us a lot of tools so that we're quite free into using the data the way we want to. So we had made multiple visualizations, some that are being used to explain what type of business we have and what we're doing. Others uh, for troubleshooting and more uh, the network assurance kind of team. There's nothing worse than an electric charge point not working, especially for an EV drivers, because it means that you might not be able to go back home. So Device Pilot help us to visualize when a charge point isn't up uh, and help us to understand where to target and will be triggering uh, visits based on the KPIs visualization that we've created. Uh, so we had one example of um, Device Pilot helping us to sell more charge points to one, uh, one of our customers, a shopping, shopping center. Looking at the KPIs from Device Pilot, we saw that every day 100% of the charge points were used and that was for every single day of the week. So uh, from, from that visualization, our sales team managed to convince the customer to add more charge points at that specific site. Uh, Device Pilot team is great, uh, amazing people, very fast, they, they have a good knowledge as well and they're always trying to help to understand how the platform is going to be able to help the business that they're addressing too. In, in our case, uh, we had many, um, many KPIs that were built because of the help of Device Pilot. We intend to use Device Pilot to, to allow us to change uh, the normal reactive part of a supporting activities to a proactive part. We want to be aware before anyone else is of the conditions of our assets. Um, Device Pilot is providing this um, ability for us to get to a more proactive um, decision making basically. That's fantastic, thank you so much. Really My pleasure, that was easy, that right, was good, fine. Well. Oh, okay, yeah. great. <laughs> one take one.